Uh, I'm gonna be wearing these Free People jeans that I got a couple of days ago in the mail. I'm gonna wear them all week, guys. And that's what I'm saying. When you buy things that are costly, wear the heck out of them. So I'm gonna wear, uh, since I'm going to the office this week, I'm gonna be wearing these jeans, of course, with a different top. So I will be chronicling the different looks as I go during the week here to show you guys how you do it or how not to do it okay don't forget to subscribe i forgot to show that i had these on with the outfit that i had on today i had these on i don't walk with uh, shoes on my beautiful carpet so this is the shoes that i had on with this outfit today with my um thrifted vintage sweater really early so can't really see me but so what I'm wearing this morning with my fancy golden goose sneakers and this sweater it's cool and definitely or cold 49 to be exact so I'll see you guys a little later when I get home show you with my shoes on well not here because i don't wear shoes in my house but wearing those jeans again like i said The office now. <sighs> okay, so I'm working in the office today, as you can see. So I don't know when I'm gonna vlog again. So I'll just see you guys, whatever day that is. Today, later, whenever. I'll just see you guys then. Okay, have a good day. Another day, guys. This is what I'm wearing today. This uh, creepy looking hoodie and the free people jeans. And I'm gonna wear, be wearing my um, black little mini uh, Uggs for my feet. I couldn't find my sneakers in my closet. They're in there, but I wasn't gonna look for them. I should have done it last night, but I didn't do it. So this is what it is. It's still early. It's six. 45 a.m. so the lighting is kind of not that bright but this is what it is the outfit I told you I'm gonna wear these jeans all week you spend money expensive money wear them every day a whole week train yourself guys see ya okay guys so I wanted to come on here real quick I'm gonna do this quick haul okay Call. Hi guys, I'm building my Legos and I'm ready for a bit of this in your little video. All right. Okay, yes. Okay, so the first thing that I got I know. The first thing that I got here is gonna be one of many, many calls because I have other things that are delayed that are coming. Uh this cute little little pouch here that I got. It's like a cute little bag here you know what i'm saying just to carry around on a friday or something like that really really cute the little pop of color the red and it's it's a decent size like i said this is something that you could use to just do something really local 
or something like that the mall something where you don't want to be having something uh very heavy or use it uh or if you don't want to use a sling bag that day okay that's the first thing the other thing that i got here was a little makeup bag little makeup bag uh, this little checkered green i love this color green cute little makeup bag that i can carry i have a whole bunch of little makeup bags like this that i like to carry and switch around depending on what purse i'm carrying okay that's that then i got this here this cute little quick haul uh this cute little tote bag uh, many of you might not know, but I am really into like horror movies and scary movies and stuff. Look, yes, so I just got this cute little tote bag. When I feel like I don't want to be carrying any kind of fancy bag or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so this is that tote bag right here. I might use that little, um, that might be the thumbnail. I might use that little checkered thing for that who knows i like a mix and match kind of vibe so that might work for that and then it's so funny because i didn't even do it like it was subconsciously because i just saw these and they were really really cute of course the socks look the socks too that's cute really really cute so I have the little bag and the sock. So I might coordinate that together, wear them at the same time or not. Who knows? Maybe yes, maybe no. I do have other things coming. So this is going to be like a long vlog. So I just wanted to get certain things out of the way. Before I forget and before I make my omelet for work. I had to clean up the plastic that was peeling up here because I'm not like a neat freak. Um, I just get annoyed. So I, I needed to trash that. So anyway. The next thing that I have here is this cute little, it looks kind of crazy. I was gonna think about put, putting this in my bathroom. It says eat shit. It's a, look, it's a little cat because you know in the, in my bathroom I have this, this other one that says, yeah, I'm sorry. I just want more this of this. Is, this is like friendly, friendly. As you can see. And others of you or some of you that are subscribed to my channel will be surprised with this. Oh, let me show you the last thing before I get to that. I got me this checkerboard um, mat that I'm going to put in the bathroom. Um, I'm not going to open it now. Or maybe I should. So I can see what it looks like. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I did leave the size when I ordered it. What the heck? A little checkerboard, heart-shaped little mat that I'm going to put in the bathroom. Okay, guys? So anyway, that was the little miniature haul for now, like I said. There's other things coming that I'm going to show you, but I wanted to get this out real quick. Some of you might have asked me before on my DM, have DM'd me in the past about, oh, when are you going to do tarot again? When are you going to do tarot? Um, you know what I'm going to do tarot when you guys, I just, just know that you guys don't understand that that takes, it's very draining to do uh, uh, tarot you know what I'm saying and there's only one person that I watch on YouTube that does tarot and this particular person's channel that has been doing the tarot I'm not gonna disclose if it's male or female but this particular person has been doing tarot for long and when I see the numbers of the subscription it's sad okay so you know what I'm gonna start doing tarot there it is you know what I'm gonna do tarot again and I have to hurry up because the lighting that's why I wanted to do this quick call because I, I don't want to pile up up there. Can you please stop? It's unnecessary. So when, you know what I'm going to do, Tara? When, when you guys start watching my vlogs, 
because I do my wonderful vlogs of me and my time and my son and everything like that. When I get 50,000 subscribers, then I'll throw in tarot readings in the mix of my vlogs, okay? That's when I'm going to do uh, uh, do the um, the tarot again. Other than that, no, because you I have subscribers and you guys don't watch my videos and stuff like that. And some of you I appreciate because you do say hi to me and you make comments. You Whoever that is, I appreciate you. I love you, okay? Whether it's one person or three. But the point is, you want to know when I want to do tarot? When you guys start watching my vlogs and I have 50,000 subscribers, okay? That's when I'll do it. Because that's very draining and it takes a lot of energy and spiritual energy like that. And that's when I'm going to do it. So anyway, I got this little tarot card here because I thought it was really, really cute. And I wanted to show it to you really quick before I go make my um, uh, scrambled eggs with spinach. Uh, for work so these are the cards you know they're kind of cool they're kind of cool i got them because it's melanie martinez i don't know if some of you guys know who she is she's a singer very eclectic very unique girl that's why i like her because she does her music and she lives her life how she wants to you know what i'm saying with her style her look and her music anyway so i got these because they were really really cute really really different and i don't know why i got them because you know i don't do tarot but i got these so that's the answer to the question for you guys that are inquiring about tarot. I'm going to do tarot when I have 50,000 subscribers and when you watch my vlogs. And since none of you guys are watching really my vlogs, what makes you think I'm going to do tarot readings and put all that energy in there and nobody's watching it? I don't think so, okay? So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and make my um, scrambled eggs and spinach that I'm going to take to work tomorrow. I know this vlog is it's different days on this vlog, okay? It's so much. It's, I think it's going to be a week of vlogging days on here. Okay, different days. Today happens to be um, a Wednesday. So that's all I know. Wednesday. Today's Wednesday, January 31st. So, you know, that way when I go back and I can see how many days I'm putting together. So, anyway, because I'm going to vlog into the weekend. So, anyway, I'm um, going to go ahead and make my eggs. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow or something like that. I'm not going to vlog for the rest of the night. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, or Friday guys bye honestly the world the planet is upset because my hands are cold it's 54 degrees it's just I, I just can't can't deal with this I, I, I just I'm used to being in this warm heat that I get moody when it's cold guys happy Thursday Okay, so we're going to Ross, guys. I haven't been to Ross in a minute, so I need to just get a candle for myself. No. What is this? Mm. Positive vibes. Deodorant? Interesting. This is like a, I don't know what that is, a spray or something? I have to get back to that. It's kind of confusing. Let me go to where I can find my my creams for my face, guys. Uh-huh. Got Revive Floral Steamers, I guess. For when you take a shower. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Interesting. Wow. Uh huh. Ross never disappoints with the weirdness, I tell you. Yep. I guess we're getting ready for Easter. Yep. Easter. I'm right here. We're getting ready for what I just said Easter. Bunny rabbit is taking over with the whatever this is. Uh huh. Let me see what's in here. Anything that I can treat myself with, guys? 
<sighs> Going insane, guys. Any good jellies here? I do love, do love apricot. I'll tell you that. I love apricot jelly. It's really, really good. Apricot jam, whatever you want to call it. Really, really good. Made in Italy. Um, hmm. Uh -huh. <sighs> Doesn't disappoint. Let me go look at the candles. Yep. Plenty of baskets if you want some baskets at Ross or whatever. This is the furniture, guys. Why is it, why is this, why if you're is this interested. There? Why is this there? That thing right there. I'm home now, as you can see. Uh, it's kind of dark now. Oh, this is my today fit. Might be my tomorrow fit too. Who knows? But anyway, I'm home now. Oh, I'm gonna get ready to How eat. So. Yes, exactly. Mm. Mm. There's no crunch in this, so you're not gonna hear crunch. Mm. Look at that! Creative. Do I, I'm doing tight to speak in there. There is no way to do it. I decided to eat. <sighs> I gotta slow down. I might show you in between eating or after I eat. Um, some of the things that I got at Ross. Um, it wasn't a lot, but you know, one of those things is a candle. So, of course, of course, you know, I go for it for my candle. Mm. And as an art teacher, uh, uh, last yesterday, as a teacher, the art teacher for a paintbrush, like a small one. And she said yes, so I got a small print bush. I didn't look for it. You know they sell those at the dollar store. It's kind of just pop and squat in your space. You never really know what exactly you're going to see. Okay, so I got full off of one of those burrito tacos or whatever, so it's cool. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. I want to get this part of the haul out because... This vlog is going to go into tomorrow and I'm not going to be having time to do all this stuff. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, we stopped by the thrift store real quick. This was for an accident, meaning I went to only to the thrift store because I needed to use the restroom. So I went to the, 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 the thrift store really quick. This is the one that we said we would not go to because it sucks. The one in Coral Springs. Exactly. Anyway. So I walked around really quick and I think I got some clips, clips of that after I went to the restroom. So I found this. A uh, decorative plate, you know how I am with my decorative plates. If you see my home, you see I use this to put it on my walls, either change some and put this one on, which I might either add this one on or take some, someone, one of those off, who knows. But this is what I got and I paid $3 for it with gold, uh, as you can see, uh, uh, trimming on there, which I love. <laughs> That's pretty, really, really pretty. And this is my color scheme. And the other thing that I got, which was only two things at the thrift store, was this mug okay this i looked it up and it was pulling up mugs for 65 dollars 70 dollars so this is like a i don't know i paid three dollars for it regular price and the bottom says i could take this off now the bottom says uh bp8 so i don't know if that's the brand or, or the company brand. that made it yes um so it this has I, to be the brand yeah so and is as you can see name? it's like that as you can see, the handle there is very unique. That's why I got it. And it's the color is beige. And then look at the inside. It's like an orange. And I mean, I really love. I like that. I always look. I always. I always. I always think about the orange part. Actually. Yes. This is what makes it really unique too. That the inside is orange. So for my tea, my coffee, whatever. I've been doing a lot of tea now. So this is the one that I got. Today for $3. Okay. That's the thrift. Okay, so now, really quickly for the um, 
Ross Hall. We went to Ross, like you can see. Got these glass uh, tumblers here, drinking glasses. And I paid 99 cents for them, okay? I only got two because I have other glasses that I have. I buy them in two when it's a particular thing. These, you can find them on CB2 and you're going to pay for one of these. When I saw the last time, you're going to pay, I don't know what you're going to pay, like 6 $7, or something like that. With this kind of ridging like this. Okay. I paid 90, what did it say? Yes. I paid 99 cents at Ross. And there was like six of them, I think, in there. I only got two because I don't need a lot of glasses like that. And I did for when I'm making my iced coffee and I want to put some whipped cream on top because of the edge. See, this is what I'm saying. When you can find things that CB2 and other places are selling for six, seven, eight dollars, look, I found them for 99 cents. Of course, you're not you might not find this at your Ross or whatever because Ross is like TJ Maxx and Marshalls. It's, if you get lucky, you see it and that's it or whatever. Sometimes some stores have repeats. Sometimes they don't. Anyway, uh, you saw me filming that coaster. Of course, I got it because I felt like it was waiting for me. Uh, I paid a dollar and forty-nine cents. If you saw the, I s recorded the price. I did get my candle. This is Fresh Breeze Exclusive Batch Aroma. I got this. You know, I need, I don't know if you can see in the background there. See there, I have my candle. I have to have always a candle. When it's once finishing, I get crazy. I need to make sure I get more. And I already went through my supply that I got myself for Christmas. I went through it, and it was like six candles. And um, I got another. I'm glad it's Friday, guys. I'm tired. I had a long day. I'm excited. Tomorrow, I have the vacuum. And I have a lot of things to do tomorrow, but they're kind of fun things, so it's all good. So anyway, continuing with the haul. Oh. I got this um, organic deodorant. Life doesn't stink. I had to try it. It's amber sage charcoal. See, this is the kind of stuff I like to try. You know what I'm saying? It smells really really nice organic and there's nothing wrong with organic okay so that's a good thing the ingredients are very very clean and that's what i like if you guys are not into that if you i don't know what deodorant you use but if you guys can try and get deodorant that's kind of organic that doesn't have a lot of crap into it please do that because a lot of these regular deodorant stuffs like that do i need a shave anyway a lot of those regular places anyway you that that sell deodorant like regular ones they have a lot of chemicals on there and as you know it's it's not really good for us so if you could get organic please get organic and the last thing that i got that i needed to get was a serum for my face of course and i got this one skin because i have other uh products uh from this brand and um let me open it right here skin this this brand is from england that's right it's from england why does the box look like that it better not be used um let's see it was taped up oh wow is this okay skin Hyal hyaluronic acid and peptides facial serum i don't know what i paid for it but i don't care because i'm really into my facial stuff like that and my oil that i have now is finishing so i needed to get another one so i got this one and i think it was what was this anyway I got it at Raw Skin. If you're interested in this brand, I really, really love it. It's really, really good. I'm using this, the the facial cream right now, and I really love it. And I always get questions, especially like today at work. My coworker was asking me, what do I use on my face? And I kept it real with her because I'm not going to lie. I don't go to Ultra. I don't go to Zimbabwe. I don't go to whatever that place is called that you guys, girls, buy your lipstick and stuff. I go to, like I told her. I go to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Ross, wherever I can find these creams and stuff like that that are 50 and older or whatever, or things like this, this is what I buy. I'm not going to be paying $50 and $60 for creams and all that stuff. Y'all can do that if you want to. I don't really care. I'm not going to. Oh, I forgot. The other thing that I got recently was, I don't know if you can see it right there, this little clown right here. It's supposed to be a little lamp. I think I posted it on Instagram. I might have to take it to a lamp man because it's hard for me to get the little thing out of there the, for the lamp to change the lamp. Anyway, to change the light bulb. So, um, okay, so the other thing that I wanted to show you that I did, uh, that I got vintage, for made from Japan, of course. These. Really, really love these. Really, really love these right here. 
okay they're shakers but you know you could i could use it for whatever i want because you know i'm into clowns so i really really love these very very cool very very unique maybe it'll be the thumbnail because every time i, I want to have a certain thumbnail it always shows some craziness that i don't even like it's like what is this thumbnail so anyway guys this is gonna be it from right now i'll see you guys tomorrow in the morning or whatever time i don't know whenever i pick up the camera to, to film because i have things to do so i'll talk to you guys in the morning bye bye so i finally got me one it's really really cute as you can see very very nice Reminds me of home. I haven't had coffee in like two weeks. I've been drinking um, tea instead. And I've been really, really liking that. Just giving the body a little rest from coffee since I always have coffee. So put a little bit of whipped cream there and the coffee is Chamberlain. Coffee. So anyway, I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. I want to do a couple of chores around the house. Vacuum I'm washing right now, so when I get dressed later, because I'm, yeah, I'm, I am gonna go out. I'll uh, catch up with you guys later. See you then. Where the hell's the things going on here? What is this? This is like a regular type of thing. These are like, uh, What the hell is that? Missing an ear? Let me see. This doll has all these things in there. Every day is a hit, guys. I don't want. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of uh, pottery stuff. No clowns. From what I'm seeing here. Hey guys, we're right now. Yeah, guys, look, we do that car wash. It's so fun. The car wash right now. So we're gonna take you through the car wash machine. And look, 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 look. all right, this is, this is like this is like universal. Uh, yeah, right? Universal, but for the vehicle. Yes, of course. Don't worry. It's, it's a, it's a look, look, look at it. Oh I guess. Look. see I'm home I'm a little bit tired flustered <sighs> I want to get ready to do this haul for you guys this is the today outfit I took all my shoes I don't have shoes in my house so anyway I'm gonna go with the all right guys believe it or not I'm tired I'm very tired from what I did today so I'm gonna go ahead and show you this uh, little haul that I have here some things that I have accumulated that I didn't show you from before okay so um I think I showed you um okay all right I left my sandals over there okay so this is the first thing that I thrifted I think I showed it last night I don't remember if I did it's fine this little vintage mug here with the uh, very unique handles there okay that was the first mug that I got and I actually have um oh let me just get this out here for that I actually um today when I went to the thrift store I found this one too very very pretty black I love the, the colors how they pop and, and I think it says mex 72 so I don't know maybe that the year the person was born or when they made it whatever so that was the second thing that I found 
uh, from the thrift store. Then I found these really, really cute. Um, I just like them because if I want to have my yogurts in here or my fruit or if I want to have iced coffee, whatever I want to do, these were $3 a piece, these ones here. And I like them because they just look really, really cute. Very, very cute there. I only got two. I did find these, uh, this little, um, I collect these, what are they called? You know, those uh, dolls, stacking dolls. This was $3 intact. Right here. Oh, it's not proper. Right here. $3 for this. Okay. And then I got these. Well, let me do this here. I found this, um, what is it called? Ho made in Holland. This cute little like wooden shoe, but it's made out of ceramic. So I could put it there with my rest of my blue and white collection. Really, really cute. I paid $2 for this. Made in Holland. And then I have this blue and white um, thing that I found here. It was well, not thing. It's some, some chopsticks. Blue and white. I had to pick that up. What does it say there? Six. Blue and white. You know I have my blue and white theme. And in reference with the blue and white, I got this beauty right here very very beautiful I love it I do that to see if there's a thumbnail because I never got a thumbnail that I like anyway so anyway I got this vintage um, horse from Russia blue and white beautiful as you can see uh, and I got this really really cute um, basket this is a particular name. I, I watch this uh, girl that thrifts all the time. This is a particular brand. I forgot the name, but anyway, $4 for this and it has stations in there. So I really like that. And this one is new. Still have it in the plastic. Still have it in the plastic. This beautiful mug here that you could put in the microwave and i think it says um dishwasher safe as well so i got this beauty right here really really cute it's really really pretty very has a good weight to it for my tea coffee you got to be careful i mean these roses are kind of i just like it because i thought it was going to be smaller but it's a really really good size so i love it you know i love pink so you know what that is with that so anyway, oh my God, I'm tired. I need to take a nap and I still have to go out. I have an appointment at two. Why do I have this on the floor here? I vacuum my vitamins. Maybe they'll kick it soon. So anyway, I also did go to the Korean to get my snacks. Um, they're in the kitchen. I'm not going to get that. So anyway, I wanted to show you... Uh, a holy grail two things that are holy grail okay i know if you guys are following the world or whatever okay you know everyone is wearing these um not everyone but people are uh, have these sneakers that are uh, trending or they're in or whatever these uh, what are they called they're called uh the i think they're the gazelle i don't know who makes it i think it's uh, adidas or something like that anyway i have white sneakers already okay but i wasn't gonna pay a hundred dollars or a hundred plus for these these adidas gazelle whatever they're called that everyone's wearing now i have white sneakers they're more clunky you know what i'm saying so i needed like a pair of sneakers that are kind of flat and if you know those brands that i'm telling you about they're like flat but gazelles or whatever they're kind of flat they're not chunky like my i have nikes that are white but a little bit of black they're chunky anyway so i found these i cannot link them even if i could i wouldn't link because i don't really link anyway but the point is um i found these and you tell me in the comments or not if these are not like those adidas gazelles or whatever okay okay i call these not the adidas gazelle i call these 
the gem appels. Okay, I call these the gem appels. Look at this. Look at this beauty. Look at it. Let me go get my son his lunch real quick, and I'll tell you how go much ahead. I paid. Okay, so anyway, I paid for these gem appels. Okay, gem appels, twelve dollars. Okay, look at them. I've already worn them. Okay. So I'm showing you these, just the point of me showing you these is that if you want to buy them, because for some reason I see online a lot of people, or I just see a lot of them on sale now. Like people that have used them and they have them on sale. The white ones, the colored ones, which I find very weird and interesting. So I'm not gonna pay a hundred and plus for the Adidas gazelles or whatever. But I will pay $12 for these, which are the, does the same exact thing. They're flat, they're white, and they have a little bit of black. Okay? That's my point. See, I keep it real. This is not for whatever. Pretending or whatever. I'm just showing you what it is. My channel is real. Now, I did get these. And that's the point that I'm saying. You have to know what really moves you, what you really like for you to buy is my point anyway so i did get these i'll show you and, these and what's interesting is that these ones that i got okay these like are a real brand those ones are gem appels okay they're they're not puma they're not adidas they're gem appels that's the name i gave them but anyway these are a brand these are puma and they're nowhere they were nowhere near the price of what these adidas gazelles are selling for even the colored ones so i got these Oh, it kind of matches but i'll show you what i'm wearing on my feet today i'm wearing my louis vuitton slides I'm wearing these today okay i didn't show you these before either so i'm showing you now anyway so i got these really really cute the color that i wanted like a lighter pink because i have golden goose gold sneakers but they're like more like a like a hot bright pink anyway the point is i love pink and i got these okay fraction of the cost so you have to know what you're doing like if you want to go ahead and buy are you, are you gonna sit down and eat uh, yeah, but then I need to find my Lego piece. I'm okay when i leave i gotta leave so that's what i'm saying my son has sneakers too he has plenty of sneakers he just likes wearing the same ones so anyway the point is is that i'm very economical and i know how i get things and if you want to follow and just get what everyone else is getting, it's good. But I'm just trying to give you a helpful tip. If you could find these where you live, uh, this was in a store here. So is there's no link. So even if it was thrifted, I can lick it. So the point is $12, look, good condition. And if you're a person like me that you have several of the shoes, you know that those shoes are going to last you. And I don't know what's going on with these people selling these gazelles online. Go look for them. There's a lot of them on sale. They use them. And they put them on sale. So if it were that good. Okay. Thank you. If they're basically that good. Why are they wearing them for a little bit. And then selling them. That's all I'm saying. Because me with these. When I'm done with them. Whenever that is. It's going to be a long time. Because I have different shoes. I'll just put them in the trash. I mean. See what I'm saying? So people spend all these monies on these sneakers and then they, they try to resell them. You're not going to do that to me because I use up my sneakers and stuff like that. So that's the point is what I'm saying. So anyway, I'm going to wear these slides today. Well, that's what I'm wearing with my outfit. I didn't show you these before. Uh, I got these for Christmas from a secret admirer. Okay. Uh, I'm wearing these today because I'm showing off my pedicure that I got last weekend. The pedicure that hurt my feet. Remember? All right. Getting ready to leave to go to my, my appointment and when I get back I'll finish the the haul. I got two jeans I gotta um, show you guys. Most likely a turn. Wear these. I don't wear shoes in the house. Disgusting. Alright, so I'm gonna go now so I'll see you guys. So I'll see you guys when I get back to the crib.
have to pay before I go. Some energy. I do have coffee at home. Okay, so as you can see, I'm back home, guys. I'm back home from my appointment. I'm tired. But I did want to show you uh, these uh, 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 jeans that I got in uh, to show you how I let's try it on with you. And then uh, that'll be it because, you know, I'm tired and it's been a long day, guys. Not a long day, but I'm tired and stuff like that. And I already, this video is kind of going to be long. So the first pair of jeans that I got are these ones here. Um, I'm gonna try them on. Right now, you see I'm wearing these beautiful uh, flowery things. So let me try on these. Hey guys, two. I don't know if you can see. I'll then, what is this cop doing? I'm gonna show you. These are kind of like uh, barrel jeans. They're kind of like wide right here and they're not that low to the bottom like that where you can see like your ankles a little bit. I really love them and they fit really nice. As you can see, these are really nice actually. I like these more than the free people ones that I was wearing that you saw me wear in the beginning of the vlog. Uh, I really, really like these. Let me show you in the mirror. Let me show you here like this. If you can see it like this, they're really, really nice. I really like them, how they fit. And they're kind of like, see how they fit? They're kind of like a little bit wide. And they fit really good. I really like these a lot. These were a good deal. I don't know if I told you where I got these, but let me try on the other ones. These are cool too. They're kind of loose, but they have like a... These are really nice. I like these a lot too. These are good picks. They have like the... If you can see like white stitching on there. I'm going to show it closer up. White stitching and stuff like that. They're kind of baggy. They're kind of cool. I really like them. Really, really like them. Let me show you the other one. See here? They're like uh, like the white stitching on the sides with the cargo. I love that. You know, I don't like to be like what everyone's doing, but watch people do this stuff too. You know what I'm saying? With the lining, the stitching, the white stitching. Why are you looking like that? It looks nice. I'm in over here because you're back here. Dope on the road. Oh my God. Dope on the road. You almost hit me. Dope on the road. Dope on the road. Dope on the road. What's what's the picture? Okay, excuse me. All right. Love it. Really, really love these jeans. Good. Let me go ahead and I, um. No haircut. I'm changing. Right, oh, I turn on. All right, guys. So anyway, my son just told me that mom, you don't look your age. She's forty seven. Of course. I mean, nowadays people don't get old. I mean, who would think that I'm almost fifty? Like, thank the Lord. Look at I that. Look at that. Look, look at them. Look at how cute. I mean, listen, I look like I looked in high school. And actually, to be honest with you, I think I look better now than I did in high school. In my opinion. I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog, okay? It's been really, really long. I'm going to go ahead and eat. I haven't eaten all day. It's right now currently. The video is going to be live because this right now is like 3.45, yes. And I haven't eaten. I only had my lunch. And I'm really hungry right now. So, uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really Bye. appreciate I hope you enjoyed this vlog. You better. And I'll see you guys um next time. Bye. Whenever, whenever that is. A week or two or whatever. Bye. Bye. Bye.